Have you ever wondered what would happen if the sun's magnetic field flipped? A fascinating question, isn't it? This celestial body, the sun, that we usually associate with providing light and warmth, actually holds a magnetic field, a powerful, invisible force that serves a crucial role in the solar system. Now imagine if this magnetic field were to flip, to reverse. Sounds like something out of a science fiction novel, right? But here's the thing. This flip isn't as far-fetched as it may sound. The sun, much like our Earth, possesses a magnetic field. But unlike the Earth's fairly stable magnetism, the sun's magnetic field is a bit more, shall we say, temperamental. It's a dynamic, ever-changing force that shapes the weather of our entire solar system. This magnetic field originates from the sun's core, where temperatures and pressures are so high that nuclear fusion occurs. This process releases immense energy and generates electrically charged particles, or plasma. The constant motion of this plasma, combined with the sun's rotation, creates a dynamo effect, generating the sun's magnetic field. This magnetic field extends from the sun's interior, out into space, forming the solar magnetosphere. The sun's magnetic field isn't uniform, though. It's more like a tangle of magnetic loops and lines, some of which burst through the sun's surface, creating sunspots. These sunspots are areas of intense magnetic activity and are the birthplace of beautiful, yet potentially disruptive, solar flares and coronal mass ejections. Now here's where things get really interesting. The sun operates on an approximately 11-year cycle known as the solar cycle. During this cycle, the sun's magnetic field goes through a dramatic transformation. It flips. That's right, the sun's north and south magnetic poles switch places. And this isn't a one-time event. It happens every 11 years or so. This flip is a significant part of the solar cycle and is closely tied to the level of solar activity. Solar activity peaks during what's known as solar maximum, when the sun's magnetic field is the most twisted and the number of sunspots is the highest. Conversely, solar activity is at its lowest, during the solar minimum, when the magnetic field is the least tangled. Just as Earth's magnetic field protects us from solar radiation, the sun's magnetic field plays a critical role in regulating solar activity. It influences the production of solar winds, the occurrence of solar flares, and the ejection of plasma into space. Understanding this magnetic field and its cycle is key to predicting solar weather and mitigating its potential impacts on our planet and beyond. Every 11 years or so, the sun's magnetic field undergoes a dramatic shift. This event, known as the solar cycle, is a fascinating part of our sun's life and has been observed and recorded by scientists for centuries. Picture this. The sun's magnetic field, just like Earth's, has a north and a south pole. However, unlike Earth's relatively stable magnetic field, the sun's field is in a constant state of movement. This is due to the sun's rotation and the motion of plasma within it, which generates a magnetic field. Over roughly an 11-year period, the sun's magnetic field gradually becomes more and more tangled until it reaches a point where it can no longer sustain itself. At this peak of magnetic chaos, something astounding happens, a pole reversal. The sun's north and south poles flip, essentially resetting the magnetic field and starting the cycle anew. Past evidence of these flips can be found in the form of sunspots, areas of intense magnetic activity on the sun's surface. Their frequency follows the same 11-year cycle, peaking at the point of magnetic field reversal. This phenomenon, while seemingly abstract and distant, is actually crucial to our understanding of the sun and its behavior. It's like the heartbeat of the sun a regular rhythm that drives many of the sun's activities. Scientists have been studying these cycles for years, using tools like solar telescopes and space weather satellites to gather data and deepen our understanding of this celestial powerhouse. However, there's more to this story than just a magnetic field flip. This flip, while routine in the sun's life cycle, can have significant implications. While the sun's magnetic flip is a natural occurrence, it's not without its potential issues. As our sun approaches the peak of its activity, we are witnessing heightened solar activity that could potentially disrupt our daily lives. For starters, we've seen an increase in the number of solar flares and coronal mass ejections. These are essentially massive explosions on the sun's surface that release clouds of hot charged gas into space. NASA's Solar Dynamics Observatory recently captured an enormous tornado on the sun's surface, releasing a cloud of hot charged gas six times the size of Earth. While this gas cloud was not directed towards Earth, such heightened solar activity can pose significant risks such as rare, powerful solar storms that could disrupt power grids and endanger deep space astronauts. In addition to these solar flares, 
We're also noticing the formation of large coronal holes on the sun's surface. These holes are formed when magnetic fields on the sun's surface point straight up into space, allowing plasma to escape and create solar wind. These winds can travel towards Earth at speeds of up to 1.8 million miles per hour. While these holes on their own are not extremely dangerous, if they coincide with other solar events, they can create disruptions such as power grid failures and radio blackouts. The most concerning aspect of this heightened solar activity is the potential for more frequent and intense auroras. The aurora borealis or northern lights are a result of charged solar particles interacting with Earth's atmosphere, creating colorful displays in the sky. However, while they are certainly a sight to behold, these auroras can also disrupt our satellite systems, impacting everything from GPS navigation to weather forecasting. Though we've weathered these flips before, our growing reliance on technology makes us more vulnerable than ever. As we continue to monitor the sun's activity, it's clear that understanding and preparing for these solar events will be crucial for our increasingly technology-dependent society. So, how do we prepare for the sun's inevitable magnetic flip? A question that sparks both curiosity and concern. But fear not, for humanity has a knack for overcoming challenges, and this one is no exception. The first step in our preparedness toolkit is hardening our infrastructure. As we've learned from previous solar events, our power grids and communication systems can be vulnerable to the heightened solar activity that accompanies a magnetic flip. By investing in resilient infrastructure, we can reduce the risk of blackouts and ensure that our daily lives are minimally disrupted. Next, we turn our focus skyward. To mitigate the impacts of the sun's magnetic flip, it's crucial that we improve our ability to predict space weather. These predictions help us anticipate solar events and take necessary precautions. For instance, if we can foresee a coronal mass ejection, we can take steps to protect our satellites and astronauts from potential harm. Scientists are already hard at work on this front. Take the European Space Agency's Vigil mission, for example. Slated to launch in the mid-2020s, this mission aims to enhance our understanding of the sun and its activities. By monitoring the sun more closely, we can glean valuable insights that will improve our space weather predictions. Moreover, we need to be ready to adapt. Just as we adjust our routines to the changing seasons on Earth, we must be willing to adapt to the solar cycles. This might mean temporarily limiting certain activities during periods of high solar activity, such as deep space missions. Lastly, let's not forget the importance of public awareness. By keeping everyone informed about the sun's magnetic flip and its potential impacts, we can ensure that everyone is prepared, not just the scientists and engineers. While the sun's flip may be out of our control, our response to it isn't. So let's gear up, stay informed, and embrace the challenge. After all, we're all in this together, under the same sun. The sun's magnetic field flip is more than just a cosmic event. Indeed, it's a testament to the dynamic, ever-changing nature of our universe and a phenomenon that directly impacts us here on Earth. To fully appreciate the magnitude of this event, we need to delve into the world of solar physics to comprehend the intricate dance of charged particles and magnetic fields. The sun's magnetic flip isn't some remote spectacle, but a process that has tangible effects on our planet. It influences our technology, our climate, and even our ability to explore the cosmos. As our reliance on technology grows, so does our vulnerability to solar activity. Hence, understanding and preparing for the sun's magnetic field flip is not only crucial for scientists and astronomers, but for everyone. The good news is, we're not in the dark. Scientists around the globe are tirelessly observing the sun, employing advanced technology to predict and monitor these magnetic flips. They're working to unravel the mysteries of our star, to help us prepare for and mitigate the effects of these solar events. In fact, we've already made significant strides in this field. We've observed coronal holes and solar tornadoes, witnessed the release of hot gas clouds larger than our planet, and we're tracking the sun's activity cycle with increasing precision. Each discovery, each observation, brings us one step closer to understanding the sun's magnetic flip. This research is more than an academic pursuit. It's a testament to our resilience and adaptability, a testament to our inherent curiosity and our drive to understand the world around us. As we continue to explore and understand our sun, we're reminded of just how interconnected we are with our cosmic neighbor. So, let's keep looking up and let's keep asking questions. Because every answer brings us closer to understanding our place in the cosmos.